as things go with fishing, um, sometimes things don't work out for you and um, I ended up tying a hell of a lot of traces yesterday and I was like pretty much at the end of my, my tether and I went down and I met up with uh, what we think is a piece of, of black coral. Um, but yeah, you know, I, I try to work my jig loose off the bottom and eventually I just, you know, tightened up slowly, slowly and I pulled it and it ended up coming away with a, with a fairly big chunk of, of, yeah, as I say, what we think was black coral. I mean, it's not something that you, that you really like or enjoy, you know, you want to preserve and protect all of these things, but, you know, it, it happens. You know, it came to the surface and fortunately it, it you know, it, along with it came a, a type of muscle that had actually grown onto the coral and it was, I mean, it was, it was hell of an interesting because a guy like Barry, who knows so much about the ocean and everything that lives in the ocean and, you know, just to watch him get his paws on this thing and have a look at it and inspect it and he was, you know, when it came up, it was open and he had a look inside and it was definitely a type of muscle, but then eventually he touched it and it closed up. And the cool thing is, is there's a lot of special moments on this trip with where we've had species that we're not quite sure what they are. You know, it's, it's pictures of the entire fish or the, the, the little muscle in this case. Um, you know, we've got all the different angles and all the different photos. And when we get back home, we're going to send it off somewhere to some of the scientists that Barry's hooked up with. Yeah, we're going to get to find out what it is and that's a really really cool part of, of of these adventures you know is there's there's a lot of new stuff out there that that we get to find and an experience that people don't ever see or know about you know